All right, Brian Bergner here with uh, the Daily Courier, sitting here with uh, head coach uh, Jill Blazik of uh, Embry Riddle Volleyball. And uh, coach, talk a little bit about your team this year. I mean, you guys look fantastic in the scrimmage against Young Pike College. Uh, I know you lost in the CalPAC championship last year, so you know obviously the goal is to always get that championship in CalPAC. So, where's the team at now, and uh, where are we heading? I think we're in a pretty good spot with nine returners, uh, nine returners having that experience of uh, working through the Calback tournament last year. And they're really the, the tour that's leading us. Um, but what's great about our new players is that they're very confident stepping on the floor. Um, we were able to put in all 13 players in the scrimmage uh, tonight and there really wasn't a huge drop in level or change in level um, when we made those subs. So that's nice for me because I'm, I'm confident in our bench and our depth there and I think that's going to be meaningful as we get later into the season and into the Calpac tournament at the end of the year. Talk about uh, how big it is for you to have three returning seniors, Jordan, Madison, and Hannah coming back for you, uh, you know, at the middle, outside, in your center. That's got to be a, a great spot for a coach to be in and a program to be in to, for those girls to kind of show like Veronica Norcus, you know, how to do things for everyone. Yeah, that senior class is special. Um, they are my first complete recruiting class, so they have a special place in my heart. Um, but they have played since their freshman year, and they've been on the court. They got those reps, um, and now that's starting to pay off because they are four-year players, but they've played for four years. So they bring that leadership and experience, and it's. I think it's going to pay off for us. Uh, you lead off with Loyola at the uh, Johnson and Wales tournament uh, coming up in a few days. Uh, how do you expect the girls to do with that tournament? Are you going to use it to continue to uh, refine things uh, this season, or are you really going to hope and win it? Um, our goal is always to win, um, but we definitely need to continue to work on our connectivity with our setters and our hitters, um, our serving and our passing. Uh, I, I feel like the potential is there to be great. We just have to really work on our consistency. Um, but we're definitely looking to go into the tournament and have a strong start. Um, we don't want to come home uh, giving up matches because we're not ready to play. Um, I feel like that would be a rough way to start. Um, but we're starting off right away, but I feel like it's going to be good for us to just go out and play because they definitely know how to do that. All right, Brian Bergner here with the Daily Courier, uh, sitting here with uh, outside hitter Jordan Jones. She is a senior uh, with Embry-Riddle Volleyball this season, and she is a uh, three-time varsity Lena winner. And uh, she was uh, second team all conference last year in the CalPAC. And so, Jordan, talk about the team this year. You guys look fantastic tonight in the scrimmage against Yavin Pai. Uh, are you guys ready to, to go and get things rolling here? I think so. I think what we have going for us is we have a big group of returners. Last year we were in the finalists. We were one of the finalists to go into the CalPAC championship. Unfortunately, we lost that. But coming back with such a huge returning group, and we have three freshmen. So just we already have these connections built, we have lots of confidence going in, and I think the new additions that we made to the team, including the, uh, Lindsay, who's a sophomore, and then our three freshmen, I think it's just a good group of girls who are ready to take on CalPAC again. Talk about that last year. I mean, last year you lost a lot of in the conference championship game, uh, or match, so to speak. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, does that give you any extra motivation to come back, especially it being your senior year, and you guys want to get back and win the whole thing? Oh, definitely. We all have the fire coming in. Uh, especially the three seniors, Hannah, Maddie, and I. Uh, we've been wanting to win CalPAC since we were freshmen. Unfortunately, we didn't really have the layout until last year. And this year, I think we're even in a better position than last year. What would you say uh, the strength is of the volleyball this season? Um, let's see. I think our fire is definitely going for us. We have, I think our experience is also going to help us. Um, and especially, I think, for Maddie and I, because we've grown up with Hannah as our setter, all of us being seniors now, we've already had four years of connections, and we know how to play with each other. Right. So that's what I'm most excited about is playing with Hannah and Maddie, and we're really killing it our last season. All right, Brian Bergner here with The Daily Courier, sitting here with uh, Veronica Norcus, a former Prescott High School Badger and now current Embry-Riddle uh, uh, volleyball player. So, Veronica, Talk about your transition from high school to college and uh, how that's been going so far. It's been going great. I love it. We get to play a lot more. We're practicing two times a day. It's a lot more competition. I love it. It's great.
Talk about uh, how you are dealing with your teammates uh, as a freshman. Now you got plenty of playing time tonight in the scrimmage. Yeah, um, with the team, it's like within the first couple days, it was like we've known each other for years. It wasn't like, oh, let's beat up on the freshmen. Like, we all have a great time. We're all, like, best friends at this point, so it's great. Talk about, uh, you know, Ember Little, they lost in, uh, you know, the CalPAC Championship last year. Uh, you know, is the team ready to head back to that point again this season? Oh, yeah, we're ready and we're going to take it this time.